Welcome back, Knuckleheads, to another episode of Mitchy Games, and we are here with possibly one of the greatest games, No Man's Sky. Um, <laughs> it's probably one of the most hyped games of 2016, and we're going to start playing it today. Um, I did have another rendering, or another playthrough of it, and it, the recording got so bad that I'm actually going to just kind of watch it over there. I do have another computer recording it. But we're going to start from scratch again here, so welcome. Let's see. Dewey Sockitens Corte. It's a balming 7.6 degrees Celsius. And it's actually quite toxic. That is interesting. Um, Quite interesting indeed. You can tell that the um, there's a little bit of a frame rate issue. And that's been reported through a lot of Steam accounts and stuff like that, so... Ooh, Heredium. Oh my god, I can't be believe how close we are to Heredium. Last time I played this, I was a good five minutes out from a Heredium, which sucked. Balls. So... Planet. You discovered this on 3... or 8.13.16. Mile, low, abundant, regular. Okay. So we're going to get started. We already see some creatures as well, but we're going to go ahead and uh, interact with some debris here. What is this? Reality seems to, un to fold in on itself. One moment I can see debris in another vast red orb, almost too large and too bright to behold. It knows me inside and out more than I could ever could. Could this be the face of creation itself? Or in my haze, freshly awakened state, am I being manipulated? A man burns himself... A name burns itself into my mind, Atlas. And as request, made without words, I should follow the path this being this Atlas has set for me. Except the Atlas to guide or spurn direction and explore freely. I have not seen an argument that says that you should not do this. No one has really said anything yet. Um, as people probably go down towards game, probably more definition of yes or no. But I'm going to go ahead and accept its guidance. I feel suffused with a warm glow of approval. I was lost, but now I'm found. It as acknowledge my allegiance. I feel this certain manifest will again soon. Alrighty. So, we need to go ahead and find some things. Oh, so I need iron. But we'll go ahead and... There's some... Lithium. Atlas Pass. Isotopes. Isotopes, cargo drop, fascination bead. That's good for trading. Let's see, damage machinery, new technology discovered, beam impact sigma. So, a better beam, it looks like. Destroy ships and asteroid targets and increase rate. Alright, sweet. So, I think that's for my ship. I think. What is this? Iron. Okay, we'll take some of that. And watch out because your gun, your laser thing can overheat. And your gun does, or your laser does need fuel as well. Hi. Are you going to be mean to me or no? Are you hostile or not? Eh, it's gonna leave me alone for now, but I might want to avoid those guys. <clears throat> They're looking at me, at least. Alright, let's get my ship here. And we can open up our inventory here. So, we need more of these sheets, which are built out of... What? Iron. So, let's make another one. Ew, we can make four. Sweet. So, now I need Herium's cart sheets, two of those. Zinc. I can't make anything else. So, let's go ahead and get out. So, we need a lot more things. But, since we're on the planet, let's explore a little bit, shall we? We do have a launch pad there and we do have a run 
I believe it's left shift here. There we go. It doesn't come up unless you actually press it. Knowledge stone. You learned the Gek word for give. Okay, awesome. Um. So let's go ahead and there's a heredium deposit. There are these big towers. I have not noticed them in anything else as of yet. Um, a lot of plant life will always be carbon. So if you like carbon, like I'm on a very carbon planet. So let's go ahead and actually, let's go to my multi-tool. Because I want to fix my scanner. I need more iron and just more carbon. So I need... So that's enough to repair that. Now I need some iron. Which I will get that in a second. I want to get this heredium first. Because we need a ton of this. It likes to overheat. Okay. Where are we at at the Heredium now? We're just almost there. So let's... There we go. That's enough. Alright. Let's get some iron too. Man, this rock is taking a while. Man, oh man. Ooh. Get some zinky plant going too. Alright, so we should have enough iron now. There we go. So now I have a scanner, which is my C. So I can scan for things that I need. And then there's this F, which... Well, suck it. I can analyze things now. So what's this? Your ver pilo, your ver trar pilo, something like that. So it's it's always cool to s discover things because anything that you can destroy is technically discoverable. Are those sentinels back on me again? Yeah, he's gonna leave me alone, I think. Ooh, is that gold? I might fly over there in a second. I need plutonium as well. This is an interesting planet. Um, inventory management is key in this game, so if you're looking to um, store lots of stuff, that might not always be the best case. Ooh, hold on. That, uh, yeah, they going anywhere? Okay, they're staying in that one area. I want to go see what these guys are. Well, let's see that, okay. Woo, sweet. So what do we got here? Something to damage cannon sigma. Can damage sigma. Sweet. Alright, so I have not seen any Phantom 9 yet. That doesn't mean there isn't more of it. But let's go to our tab here. So we got some neutral metal alloy. We could use a lot more carbon. Plutonium would be nice. Go ahead and transfer this or ship. Uh, ooh, we need more units. Did we not get enough? Uh, where was that rock at? So I've already learned that one. All 
Okay, so there's some more plutonium. Always, always get plutonium. It's always a good thing. Don't venture, I would say don't venture too far from the ship, especially walking wise, because there's always a better way to get around, it's usually your ship, so. So, always get your ship if you can. Uh oh, so I gotta feed this. Carbon, there we go. That works. <coughs> Give me some. Okay, so one of the things that's annoying about this game is it's telling you life support is low. That's a 75%. Don't tell me that at least probably 50 would be a good thing. Okay, so I got plenty of heredium now. I need more carbon. But yeah, so it's a lot of hunting and gathering the first time around. Um, I might see... What is going on? There's a red light over there somewhere. I think. Right over there. So, we're not too far from the ship, so it might be okay. Well, hold on. Let's go ahead and go over there. We got time. Hunt some carbon along the way. Apparently, the Sentinels aren't, like, really worried about us, so that's a good thing. Is this new? I've already discovered that. Carbon's always good. Interesting, there's something way out there. And that looks to be gold. Gold! Gold! Okay. Bypass chip required. Interesting. I think we can make one. Yes, we can. So let's see what this does. Signal scanner online. Planetary location beacons are responding. Shelter market detection wavelength online. Yada yada yada. Search for nearby points of interest. Monolith, colonial outposts, transmission, shelter. Let's go for a monolith. Because those, you get to learn language. Sweet. And now it's marked it for us. So that will take us a while to get there. But that is handy. Oh, you can do it each time. Sweet. Now, gold's good for trading. So, always... Well, let's see. Do I have some... Da -da -da -da. There you go. Where are we at now with my carbon? Come on. Oh, sweet. Set. Gold is just fantastic. I haven't seen anybody really use it yet, so it's more of a tradable option. But I am. Um, I had shitty luck in the first planet, so. Being on this planet where there's a lot of everything, I am happy. I will take all the gold I can get. Oh, so, okay, that's just telling me the model that's over there.
Oh my god, so much gold. Uh, might as well take it. It's good for money, I think. Yeah, let's get some carbon. Oh god, that's bright. Holy shit. So my game seems to be doing a lot better now that I am recording on a separate computer. <laughs> which is hilariously nice. Well, let's see if they let me alone. Ooh, plutonium. God damn it. Yes, I took a shit ton of gold. I don't know why you're in my face. Okay. Let's see if we can run back to our ship and get going on our way here. Ooh, there's another gold deposit way up there. Ooh, there's even some stuff over here. I didn't realize there was a cave. Let's go ahead and scan some stuff here. All right, we're discovering things. Carbon, carbon, carbon is always good. I right, can't destroy those. That's all iron. I mean, that's not bad. I want to see what this is. Ooh, that's cool. Let's destroy it. Tons of iron. Alright, so my inventory is full. Uh, we can transfer stuff to the starship here. So let's go ahead and... We got a full load of iron. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. And... We got a slot full of heridium, so we're good there. Let's go ahead and... Charge our life support there. Big mushroom. Sweet. Carbon. All the carbon. Oh, this is cool. Interesting areas. Oh, there's some plutonium. And a large chunk of it, too. God damn, that is a nice uh, size plutonium there. Ooh, that's a hundred. I'll just keep going down the cave. I'm kind of interested now. See if there's anything else interesting. Oh, uh, what's this? It's hanging. Nope, it won't. I can't scan it. That seems to be everything, so I'm going to go back to my ship. Alrighty. Let's get in our ship. We need crit sheets. That's fine, that's easy. Alrighty. Yay, we have our things fixed. Um... Uh, Phantium 9. Shit. 
I have zero Phantom 9. Fuck. Okay. So we need to figure out what the hell that is. Okay, there's some energy that way. Let's see what this is. Hey, Phantom 9. Exactly what we needed. Take some plutonium model here. I don't need carbon. There's a cave underneath me, that's where. I wonder. Yeah, that's plutonium. Hmm. I don't have much Phantom, that's my problem. Right now, I have 27, which isn't a ton. It might be enough to get us off, we'll see. A bunch of stuff this way. Ooh. So there's another Gek thing here. Ooh, God, there's some good shit here. Okay. Ah, uh, carbon is full again. Let's get rid of that. Alright, let's go ahead and let's learn a word. See what we learn. Gek word for high. Health is good. Oh, there's one more Thantium. There we go. Jeez, there's another one. Well, let's go learn some more words, folks. Shit, they're all over the place. I picked a good plan to learn words on, I guess. Gek word for docking. Gek word for Gek. <coughs> There's another creature I have not. Cool, new character. All right. Jesus. How far am I away from my ship? A minute. Eh, that's not too bad. I'll keep going this way then. I am having some hell of a time finding Thantium 9 today. Thank you for the milestone accomplishment. Whoa, all kinds of stuff. A lot of nothing. There's stuff there, but I can't interact with it without an atlas pass, and I don't know, I, I have yet to figure out what the frick that does. Let's go ahead and start running.
Yeah, wait, wait, wait. All right, you know what? We're gonna assume if we have enough here. I do not know if we will have enough, but we will see. Well, let's see if we got enough fuel to get the hell off this ship or this rock. All right. Nice, we have enough. All right, let's get going. Cool. There was an unknown location somewhere over here. And we will go ahead and stop. I think this is the area of the unknown. There we go. Interesting. Weird spot, but okay. What's this? Exosuit upgrade. Oh, an extra slot? Fuck yeah, I'll take the item. Why not? Anything else in here? Okay, sweet. I just got an extra slot, I think. Very nice. Someone rated that already. Yeah, this has been pretty much picked clean. Let's go ahead and save this. Alright, restore save point. That's good. Let's go ahead. Hmm. My next objective, I believe. Da, 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 da. Journey. Pathfinder in four miles. No options. Discoveries. Well, let's go ahead and get this uh, plutonium since we're over here. Emerald. That's new. Hi. Can I take some plutonium? I'm gonna see what it does. I'm gonna keep doing my thing. Yeah, it's leaving me alone. Okay. It does not care, I guess. Some of them are very, like, you do anything and it will get you. Okay. So now we need to figure out where we need to go next. Well, let's just go there. Why not? What did I break? Alright, we're going land. Cool, we're at the monolith. 
Let's start learning stuff. I close as I reach out and touch a beautiful stone marker. My mind filled with deadly knowledge and the truth of Gek history. We are the masters of the galaxy, overlords of cosmos, the earth folk was submitted by the Maya Gek domination. We were first spawned like four works in despair. See public language. My knowledge of the Gek has increased. <coughs> cool. Alright, so how many more times can I launch and get the hell off this rock? Because that's what I'm kind of concerned about now. <clears throat> well, let's go ahead and get off. Leave planet. Alright, that's what we're going to do. Boo do 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 Alright, so there's some pirates. Fuck that shit. There is the planet we were on. So we're looking for a space station. That's. Do we want to go there? Oh, that is a space station. All right. <coughs> Let's see how long it takes. A minute and a half for repulse drive. It's not too bad. I'm gonna go back to that other plan a bit and mine all that gold because damn, that was some good shit. But, um, this is kind of their fast travel, and it's very reminiscent of Star Wars. I like it, um, quite a bit. Yes, I know I have unredeemed items. Go away. Um, it seems like when my CPU is not doing much else but playing the game, it does good. So, unfortunately, I might have to be doing this weird-ass setup for the next couple episodes. Just to get this going. <laughs> unfortunately, um... So, some thoughts about the game, um, so far, um, what I noticed, PS4 and all that, uh, the PS4 version runs a lot smoother, cleaner. Um, the PC one has some issues. I don't know why, because it's a lot, it's only like two and a half, three gigs, and the PS4 one's like six? I think that's all audio issues, so, but... Like, this game should not be having the issues that it's having. It's having some issues. But, we will get that fixed. That's the one thing we will fix. Make sure everything's going all good. Whoa, oh, shit, 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 shit. I was not checking myself. Ooh, that is an interesting space station. I've seen them in the tri the the diamond shape before, but this is oh okay. This is new. This is yellow as well. Very interesting. Oh my god, the music here is so awesome. Let's go ahead and get scooped in here. I love how, like, everyone who ever lands in this place, like, always lands in wrong. And you always have to get flipped over half time. Sweet. We are at our first station. Which is epic. I think we have to go up here. Come on. Oh, wrong door. Fuck. I've done that before. I've been the wrong door. Oh, really? There we go. It, you can tell it's glitching out just a tad bit, which is unfortunate. It's having some issues. Ooh. 
Yeah, I see you. I'm going to take care of these plants first. Oh, this just turns on the light. That's, that's funny. Alright, so let's go and sell our gold first. Sell items. Wow, that's very good. Whoa. That is back up. That was glitching very weird. Okay. All the gold. Uh, <coughs> sell all this, might as well. Don't need to sell the heredium right now. Eh, I can sell... Let's just sell a hundred. So we got plenty of it. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not then. I can't. Oh. Okay. So we got about eighty thousand. If they have Phantom Nine, that would be great. No. What's this? Okay. Plutonium. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Okay, we're good for now. Let's talk to you, Sir Gek. Sales Gek. Yada 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 geck first blank give blank. Small crazy band province appears eyes of invitation. So it wants me to give it something. So give it ten units. Life form is coolly thrill. Get it gives something in exchange. Yay! Phase beam. And I need Phantom Nine. Again. I do not have Phantom Nine. Standing with the geck has increased. Alright, let's uh let's give it some carbon here. Let's see if I can do some more work with him. Something something geck. Something something geck. The trade agrees to help. Shield the maximum. Sweet. Alright, let's see what else we can do since we're here. God damn it. Milestone accomplished. New business. Earn 55,000. I think it just once it hits a certain number, it just automatically does stuff. Oh, hello. Okay. So, we need to get back to our ship. Oh, that's not our ship. Fuck. <laughs> you ever have one of those that's the wrong car moment? That was it. Right there. <laughs> Alright, so where do we need to go next? And we'll pulse this beacon. So it's telling me to go there. Oh god, my back is killing me today. Not really. It is. I have an, I'm an old person. I have an old back. Why not? Man, this game is just awesome. There we go. So we're getting there. 
I am figuring out finally how to kind of navigate all that shit. So, this is your move around button. And then your controls are your, like, I'm going to tilt the ship so I can land on the planet f with my bottom down instead of my top down. So, let's go ahead and get back on this planet here and figure out what we need to do next. I'm assuming we need to get hyperdrive because that's something we don't have yet. Uh, uh. Come on. Whoa, hold on. What is that? Weather clear, low, non-existent. Sweet. Alrighty. Sweet. Wow. Lots of stuff. One bypass chip. Coming right up. Oops. Alright, so other than the place we need to go... I like looking for models. Let's learn the language some more. Okay, so it's in that direction. That's three minute walk. Oh, that might be a three hour walk. Yeah, it's a three hour walk. Can we get in here? <clears throat> is there a door? There is a door. <clears throat> oh, cool. This looks like a shelter. And all these multi tech tools. Sweet. And our beam. Sounds good. Cool. Interesting. <clears throat> Ooh, power canisters. That's nice. Because that helps me fuel anything. A Gek Charm. Nice. Safe spot. Very nice. Alright. Let's go back to my ship here. And, oops. Ah, uh, we need fuel. Thank God. We have plutonium? Oh. Okay. We might be in a problem spot in a minute here if we don't have enough phantom. Looks like there's another outpost. But we'll go ahead and... Ooh! That's something I want to look at. See, did we land on the pad? No, we did not. That's okay. There are posts. Okay, we'll take it. Maybe there's some stuff in here we need. A lot of isotopes.
What else do we got? Lots of plutonium. That's good. Oh, hey, there's another deck. Oh. Um, let's see. Iron and carbon. So, let's just throw... Oh, hold on. Man, it's not what... Okay. What do you got for me, buddy? Valued customer. Something gek, something gek, something something. Okay, that might be human. Think with carbon iridium. The air around it smells foul. It might excuse me, the gag expression, yada yada. Go to his gas for flight. Uh, let's give it iridium. No, it's a brief thank you. It pays for my contribution to prefer something else. Nice. Well, I mean, it's something. Sweet, more multi-tool tech. There's a post. Let's see if we can find Phantom, because I think we're going to be in a hurry in a second if we don't find some. Nope. Oh my god, yes. Yes, we have Phantom now. Thank god. Sell items, I know. Because we didn't land right on the pad. Whatever. I'll deal with that later. Oh. Yay. My ship's over there. Met two aliens. So there's a lot of stuff you can really do in this game. A lot of stuff. And I will save. And I will see you guys all in the next episode. So in this episode, we've gotten everything but the hyperdrive. We will get that in the next episode, unfortunately. Um, I will try to see how I can edit these down and save them. But um, as always, guys, keep on gaming. Keep on having fun. And let's play.